Hey guys, um, this week's topic is about drugs. I guess you kind of know about that if you've been watching this week's videos. So like basically I'll be explaining kind of the different kinds of drugs and how they affect you and stuff. Do I say stuff a lot in any of my videos? Like, I think I say stuff too much. So there are like three main types of uh, like drug main types of drugs: stimulants, depressants, and hallucinogens. Depressants can be like alcohol and morphine and cannabis and stuff like that. And like in small doses, like if you have like red wine with dinner or something, um, it can make you feel relaxed and just better. And, you know, and it's nice in, in small in small doses, like alcohol. I don't know. I don't drink alcohol. I I've never had alcohol properly, so. But in, in bigger doses, depressants can be really bad, like they can cause unconsciousness and reduce breathing and heart rate and it's just bad. So like other drugs, they're like stimulants. So stimulants are like caffeine and nicotine, which people have all the time. They're people who drink coffee every day or tea every day. I kind of want tea now. People around the world who start their day with coffee or a cigarette or both. You know, it's fine. Stronger stimulants. They can include like cocaine and speed and crystal meth. Also on the topic of stimulants, I'm sorry if I'm talking really fast. I am on really, really hyper mode because of these things which are backwards, which you can't read. But I have one canards and ah, oh, they're so tasty. So stimulants like speed up your central nervous system and they make you feel more awake or more alert. Or just more confident in general. But other effects of the stimulants are like increased heart rate, the body temperature goes up like a lot, and your blood pressure goes up, and like also reduced appetite. Like I've heard around, I think I had this in school. I I don't know. But um, when you smoke, um, it reduces your appetite and it makes you want to eat less. I think it was today actually. Someone said smoking, or maybe yesterday, someone said smoking burns calories, and I was like, wait, no. What? <laughs> so like more higher doses of stimulants or stronger stimulants like cocaine or speed or crystal meth or something, um, it uh, can overstimulate the users, it causing anxiety, panic attacks and seizures and headaches and paranoia and bad, bad things. Like uh, strong stimulants as well can mask the effects of depressant drugs like alcohol. This this increases aggression and obviously it's a massive hazard if the person is driving D don't drive and do drugs or don't drink and drive and in my case don't drive I don't want to drive when I'm older like the final main kind of drug is hallucinogens and that's like LSD magic mushrooms ecstasy stuff like that and ketamine physical effects of that is like uh, dilation of pupils, loss of appetite again, both of those, and increasing increasing your just activity in general, like talking or laughing. And obviously like with the title you get hallucinations. Like magic mushrooms are like apparently really bad for hallucination wise. Again, you can get panic and paranoia and also loss of contact with reality because of all of those hallucinations obviously. Yeah, but if you choose to take drugs, I mean it's your choice your body do what you want with it but I would advise against it you know 14 year old kid I'm not gonna try and tell you how to live your life I'm not very influential but that's not good for you at all and also as uh, someone once said to me he said don't do drugs you're on your body and it's an expensive hobby I have 16 minutes of film and probably about four minutes of actual usable footage good one yeah, I think that's it. I think that's all. Yeah, yeah, that's everything. I'll see you on Monday, Jenna. Mm, I'm getting better outros. <laughs>